Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. Guys, today here we finally get to open, I just got him a few days ago, uh, Commander Cody Chrome version, guys. So as you can see, I have him with the original Commander Cody head sculpt that he came with from the movie version. And I love it. I love it just like this. I think it looks great just like this. Um, no complaints about the figure, guys, at all. It's a reuse, obviously. It's another shell figure. It's another money maker for Hot Toys. Uh, this is the exact same body that they've been using pretty much for the clones, the chrome clones, everything chrome, right? Uh, and I can tell you that because the bodies are, feel the exact same way. They articulate the exact same way. I can tell you that the original Cody body is not the same uh, at all because the right arm on that figure comes off and obviously this one doesn't. So it's not the same body whatsoever. It doesn't articulate the same whatsoever. Uh, but it is still very, very nice. Again, very basic. Nothing crazy about the figure. Nothing out of this world. Again, it's all panels it's all uh you know reprinted reused uh what do you call it um molds so this is what we're dealing with the only thing that makes this special and cool and different is the paint application and the paint color right as you can see it's a chrome it's smooth it, there's no scuffing there's no uh battle damaging there's no, there's no scratches there's nothing like that to make it look uh, like the original version, as you can see, he's all scuffed up, he's all beat up. Um, so let's get right into it, guys. I want to start with the helmet because this is the. It comes with two. It comes with phase one, and phase two, I believe. Um, this is the uh, original Cody helmet that everybody is familiar with. Uh, I'm gonna assume that this is the phase two. Um, as you can see, beautiful. I haven't touched any of the figure or any of the. Helmets with the with my bare hands at all. I've been using the gloves the entire time just because the, the second you put a, a fingerprint on it, goodbye. So, as you can see, very nicely detailed, very nicely painted. Um, this piece attaches to it. It comes detached. You have to put that on. But again, nothing crazy, nothing new. We've gotten this, like I said, with the original right here. And this is the Phase 1. This is the helmet that comes with the General Kenobi figure, uh, just painted in white. So as you can see, this is the Phase 1 look. Again, this is another reuse and repaint from the Kenobi General Kenobi figure. This is the helmet that is optional f uh, to his head sculpt. You could pick either, either style, you could put the head sculpt on, or obviously the helmet on. A lot of people aren't using the helmet, um, and some are, obviously. Look at that. Just, again, nothing special, nothing crazy besides the paint. Um, and let's get right to the figure, guys. Uh, it comes with a bunch of hands. It comes with the long rifle, and it comes with the regular standard rifle, as you can see. Um, so I have the Cody head sculpt. Still, this thing is still a 10 to date. This is... Years old now, and look how great it still looks. If they were to reuse this, or redo this, rather, at this point, it would just need the rolling eyes, if that. But this is great. This is still perfect to date. So let's get right to the figure, guys. So as you can see, it's got the chest piece that Commander Cody has. This you got to attach as well, the antenna piece here. That comes detached. Uh, look at all the detail around the waist. Look at the belt. Look at all the pouches. Very, very nice. Again, very, very plain because it's the one color, right? The undersuit makes it look really nice as well because it's black. I wonder what it would look like if it was uh, white or red or something different like that. What would look better? Maybe a, a black and yellow would be nice. The shoes. So again... Nothing crazy, but this is beautiful. It's going to go very well with everything else. 
Uh, I don't know where this is going for me because of the, um, I filled up an entire shelf with all the clones. I had everything on a detail, uh, and then I ended up putting everything in one of the big cases and now it is fully stocked up and filled up. And now I don't know what to do. So also guys, the backpack magnetic. Really nice. Again, very basic, but very nice. That's the entire figure, guys. So again, another 10 just because it's perfect. The articulation is obviously another key point to this figure. You have to be able to do whatever the hell you want with clones, right? Um, and articulation is very important. That's why these bodies are very special. Even though we complain, right? It's all it's all mold. It's the same reuse stuff. But the bodies are what, are what makes the figure in the sense of if you're going to pose then you're most likely going to be able to pull off any pose you could imagine with these clones. Again, because of these special bodies. So as always, guys, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you in the next one.